what's up today my fellow Madden soldiers so well I'm gonna be doing today is I'm gonna be powering up Jalen Smith the new one that came out on the blitz promo so before I do that I want to let you guys know how I got him for free and it's been not one dime on him it was a grind but it was worth it because you know it was a free player so without further ado let's go ahead and get into it on Thanksgiving Day they had a limited time solos you're able to get 600 bolts you don't see them right here but it was like one of the har harvest and it said limited time so i played that so i got 600 bolts but besides that though because that's easy to attain through other stuff that they got on madden right now that they have to offer i play this here the blitz i play blitz 101 and you're able to is it gonna let me go in or what's going on here anyways yeah so i play these it's like 20 challenges you get 25 bolts for each of them so that's what one two three so that's 500 bolts for this challenge so I got those 500 and then I play these every day. Look it. I thought this I <laughs> I thought you could only play this one time. This uh these limited time. I thought you could only, I was only playing it one time and then I figured it out. I finally figured it out. You could play these up to 8 times and get 25 bolts for each. I was like, man, I could have got Jalen a lot sooner. So I play these every time they offered them. Got 25 bolts. That's 8 of them. That's uh 200 bolts. That's 200 bolts for each. So the other one, I think you get 600 bolts. I calculated wrong on the other ones out of the 20 I had. Anyways, so yeah. You're going to get 200 bolts every 8 hours on top of that. So I just saved them. And then what I did after that, I was all saving them is uh, every time you log in, I think it's every 8 hours or every 4 hours or whatever the case it is in Madden. You get a uh, 100 bolts for free. And then you go into a store and get, you can purchase for 500 coins. You can purchase another 100 bolts. So that's 200 bolts every 8 hours. Um, just for logging in and then p paying 500 coins from the store so all, all that all that I was stacking and I just let it build up I let it build up so I said okay well now for doing everything that I did I had about like 2,500 bolts or so so what I did was because the uh, house of rules I don't know if you guys know yet but they, they have the house of rules in the h2h and so when I went in there it's I know it, it's a grind because I mean, you got, you're only getting 25 bolts for each game, but in the end, when you're looking at it as, okay, well, I only need like maybe 50 games or whatever. I know it's still quite of a bit, but if you have extra time, you can go ahead and grind it. I went in here, you get 25 bolts each each game. I literally went here last night because I seen Jalen Smith was only up for so long. I didn't know yesterday was the last day he was going to be up to buy with bolts. So I grinded. I grinded the H2H until I got the rest of my 4,300 bolts. And then I bought them in a store. So that's how I did it. I got all, I did all the solos, everything I can. I got close to attaining the bolts. And then I went to um, House of Rules. And yes, I did grind a lot of games. I probably did like at least 50 games. I'm not even going to sit here and lie. I did grind like at least 50 games, maybe a little bit more in order to get them. But I wanted them for free. So that's, that's why I did it. If you don't want to get them for free, you can actually go in the store and buy certain packs and get bolts. And then went to the store and bought him. Now he's not available in the store no more because he was a limited time. However, what you can do, you could go get another player that's in the store, sell that player, and then go buy a Jalen if you want to. But I'm just saying you guys know before I power him up. That's how I got him for free. Just so you guys know. If even if you guys want to get him or you guys want to get another player, whatever the case may be, be wise, use your bolts, get one of the good players. You can either use a player for training, sell him, and get a player you want. So you could do either or. So that's what I did. I know it's a lot of grinding. Some people don't want to do it. Some people don't. But like I said, I didn't want to spend money on Jalen. I wanted to get him because they had to offer him. So I got my free player, and that's how I did it. So now the next thing that I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, power him up now. Add him to the squad. This is not going to be a Cowboy lineup update just so you guys know. This is just going to be powering them up. I will do an update later on. So anyways, when I complete this set, they gave me like, what, 25 bolts? Just so you know, I mean, the master tickets. Look at This sells for one training. It goes into two sets, which is the master sets. That's insane. I think last year they went for like 1,500 coins. I I I'm going to leave them right here because I'm hoping that that's not all they go for right now. Yeah, because that's insane. I do have this Charles Tillman that I got from the Dean Diamonds. I accidentally got him. It was it was hideous. I was yeah I was mad about that. That I actually got I pulled the wrong guy. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of him for training because I need a need him to power up Jalen. So where is he at? Dak, oh, Dak Prescott haven't went up yet. So I think he'll go up on the third or something like that. So now. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna we'll put we'll put middle linebacker because I'll find him faster. Let's do that. 
All right, here's this card right here, just by itself. 87 speed, 91 acceleration, 87 play rec, 85 tackle, 73 strength, 76 block shade, 92 hit power, 84 zone coverage. As you know, he gets Enforcer. I will be adding it to him. I don't know if I'll be adding it to him right now. I might not have enough training, but eventually I will. I plan to, I plan to make some certain moves on the team and then make sure he has everything he needs to have. Where's he at? Okay, here he's right here. I've been had him on the squad. I mean, he was a low. I don't know why they kept him so low, but I think they do that on purpose in order to uh, make money later, I guess. But we're gonna go ahead and do it right now. Wow, it took a lot of training, huh? They really got me. I got 889. I'm just glad I got Sprinter on him already, though, so I don't have to spend it on that. So here's his card. All right, so what does he get? Or well, he's a great cowboy, that's definitely. So let's see his X Factors. So this is what reinforces on Hawk Shutdown. Run Stuffer, Momentum Shift. I've never seen that activated. Fear Monger, Unstoppable. Ah, I'm not going to put none of that on him. So. Clutch, pick artist, acrobat. I guess pick artist is pretty decent. Even though the tip drill and all that don't work. It, it, it don't work. I tried it all. Where's Enforcer at? What? He don't get Enforcer? Oh. Oh, that's what happened. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, 93 hit power. What's going on here? I thought he got enforced. What? Maybe I'm I'm going too fast. Yeah, this is no, that's lurker. It achieved 90 hit power, so he has to achieve a 95 OVR. Guaranteed tackle after hit sticking ball. What? I thought it was just a 90 hit power. Oh, that's crazy. Maybe you guys might know something. I don't know what's going on with this card right here. I don't understand that. That changes everything because I was literally going to put him in a different position and everything. And I don't know. I don't know. Maybe there's something going on. Maybe because this is the promo. Maybe when it's over. I have no idea. If you guys know something, please let me know because I'm confused right now. Yeah, I'm confused. So he's already in the lineup. But let's go see what what's going on. I want to see how he is as a right outside linebacker. So he'll be a 92 still as a right outside linebacker. He was like that last year. He actually he was a 98. Last year I think I had him powered he was powered up to a 98 and he ended up as a 99 gold. As a right outside linebacker and a left outside linebacker, so that was pretty good. Let's see how, let's see if it changes as a left left outside linebacker or if it's still the same. So he's still the same. So I might put him as one of those positions. I probably put him as a right outside, but I'm more mad right now because I don't understand why he don't get enforcer. So I got to figure that out. But yeah, I'm like I'm a little bit confused because I didn't I didn't think that that was gonna happen. Yeah, that kind of threw everything off. So I'm gonna have to go and do some research and just yeah figure out how I'm gonna go go about this team because that yeah it's very frustrating. But I'm happy to get him either way. I mean he is a goon out there. He does have the hit power still. But I would have liked to have the enforcer. So but like I say, he don't get it. It is what it is. Maybe later on, uh, maybe maybe there's something going on that I don't know about. But yeah, I did get him for free. That's how I did it. Just so you guys know, he's on the squad now. I will be doing a cowboy lineup. Cowboy update soon because I will be acquiring other players and I will be uh, showing you how he's looking on the team and then we'll go from there. So I'm going to leave it right here. If you guys like what you've seen, drop a like. If you guys didn't sub, sub to the channel. There will be more great and amazing content coming your way. Until next time, I'm out.